Hey everybody, so I got invited to go to the World of Concrete by Sacri. We're going to be finishing up the last and the final episode of Concrete Combat. So if you haven't checked that out, I'll have a link for that down in the description. But we're going to go out there, we're going to meet some really nice people, we're going to make some new friends, we're going to meet some old friends. That's probably the best thing about going to the World of Concrete. So let's go check it out right now. Hey guys, so I'm headed over to the area meet, meet up with uh, Darren and Luke. I'm gonna catch an Uber, head over to the convention center. They got me staying at the, the Vidara, which is right here. Right off the strip. Just a short walk. But let's go meet up with Darren and Luke. There's Luke. How you doing? Good. Better downstairs, I didn't know. Okay, yeah, we gotta go. I gotta I gotta get an Uber and guys here we are. World of Concrete 2022. Gonna... Hey look who I found here at World of Concrete. Uh Ryan and the gang from Victory Outdoor Services. Yes, sir. Guys, I mean, say hi. Say hi. hi. Great, great to finally meet these guys. Hopefully we'll be working together in the future sometime. Sure, so 100%. great guys. Yeah. All right, guys. So here's where we're at, the Las Vegas Convention Center. You can see this this place is huge. This is the Central Hall, and then they got the the West Hall goes way up there. It's probably like a half a mile up there. So you got the West Hall, Central Hall. Then they got what's called the North Hall is on the other side of this, and then the South Hall is way down there. So this this place is huge. And then they do an outside setup. You can see they got a bunch of stuff set up outside over here. You can go check out, but. We'll go inside and check this out. Oh, well, this is the main entrance. You get in here, and then you can go either way. You can go right or left. Central Hall is gonna be over here and right. And then there are all kinds of places to eat over there. And there's another big hall over there. So we'll go in, we'll go in Central Hall first, check that. Check that out over here. All right, just waiting to check in. Got to get our badges. They got, that's how long the line is back there. Go up here, we scan a barcode and they give us, they give us a badge to wear around our neck. Then we can get in. So here we are. It's a little early still. Sacrete's got me here. We got the finals of the concrete combat so we're gonna be we're gonna be working with sacri today there's their booth way down there so we'll go down and check that out see how what they got for a setup or just to give you an idea of the size of this, this i mean this is just one building here there's all those other buildings i was pointing out earlier but this is this is one section of this building and then it goes down into this other section here i'll show you And it just, they got booths just everywhere from anything and everything you can imagine that has to do with construction and concrete. You can see the size of this. Just goes all the way across. All right, so it's just a little bit before game time here, Concrete Combat, getting ready. Everybody's getting mic'd up, getting the makeup on. There's the... There's the two projects they're going to be fixing to, for the finals. Um, there's the tools and the products they're going to be using. A little bit, a little bit behind the scenes stuff here. Everybody's getting ready, excited. Production crew's got things going here. These guys are all back here behind the scenes working hard. There's a bunch of them. Yeah. All right, guys, we just finished up. Concrete Mike and Kenyon are the winners. Concrete combat, pretty cool guys. So this this was their square here, competing against theirs over there, and just can't, it was really really close. But those guys are the winners right there. So I'm here at the MBW booth, just hanging out with them for a little bit. 
Look at all their stuff here. They got a really nice, really and nice so setup. Got the power trials that we use. All right, so there's a screed demon we use. They got a little setup here for that. There's the gas powered one. There's the battery one over here. So they got it all set up so they can show people. We're just gonna hang out here for a little bit, meet some people, say hi, maybe give away some free stuff. All right, so here's Aaron with Creek Quote, his uh, quoting system for concrete contractors or landscapers or any type of contractors really who get just way too many quotes they're doing. His system, his software will take care of that for you and weed out the, the tire kickers and just get you under some real serious people. So creekquote.com guys, check that out if you want to. And we're gonna go talk to Aaron here. Hey, so we're here at the Marshalltown exhibit. They got all their tools all set up, ready to go. Everybody's here checking them out. Got all the rakes, their handles, all their hand tools here. Really good variety of stuff. Really nice bull float they got there. They got their, their skids. Got their decorative rollers here. So anything you need, these guys got. Um, we're gonna go check out some more stuff. So. Hey guys, we're here at Superior's booth, home of the Mag Vibe. We got the brand new Generation 3 Gen X vibrating, vibrating bull flow head. Things really cool. Plus, he's got all kinds of other tools here too to check out. Look at all these things. Cool stuff, guys. Really cool. The size of that flow. So, we're going to be testing out some of this stuff this year, showing you guys how this stuff works. There's a man right there. And they were hey, we're here watching a stampable overlay by Ben Bass. Using Stone Edge Surfaces Stamp Mix. 3 8 Using it on there. Good. Jeff here from Deco Creek. Deco Creek boys here. Yeah. Having a good time. Concrete decor store. Our inside Raider Stadium. We're getting ready to go on a tour. So we'll get to check this out this morning, and we'll get back over to the show. Hey guys, here's Chapin's booth. So these are the these are the same brand sprayers that we use right here. These guys make some really good sprayers. Chapin Extreme is the stainless steel one. Is the one we use the most, which is right here. So that one right there, that silver colored stainless steel Chapin Extreme is the one we use on all our jobs. So these are, these are some really good sprayers, guys. So if you're looking at, you know, spraying your sealers and your solvent based stuff, this is, these are the ones to get right here. So Vegas was great. You know, me, Darren and Luke had a, had a great time. We checked out some of the sites, went and, and toured some of the other resorts. We hung out with Ryan from Victory, Ryan and Daryl. We, actually took them down to Fremont Street downtown Las Vegas that was a great night but there's just all kinds of things to see here the food is really great you can't go wrong you know we stayed for we had three full days here we flew in on a Monday left on a Friday and the show was the show was absolutely wonderful meeting the people there at the show is actually probably the best part for me honestly but you know secondly just just taking in Las Vegas and have seeing everything it has to show and then, of course, the nightlife here is great. But we'll definitely come back. I hope you guys enjoyed this. You know, comment down below if you've never gone to the show and you'd like to go. And then also leave me a comment if you have gone and what your favorite part is. But this is us, this is us taking off early, early Friday morning. It's kind of a cool sight to come up over the city when it's, when it's all lit up like this. But, guys, thanks again for watching. I appreciate it. And we'll catch you on the next one.